Hi, welcome to day three. So typically, uh, guys, you know that uh, we are getting started on the world's most fastest supercomputer. So you would have selected a kind of a supercomputer by now seeing the first two videos. But day three, we are going to take this more further. So typically, um, you know that writing is a very tedious task. I have, uh, you know, created a lot of tutorials for you to ease the writing process. In fact, I would have created a lot of uh, what you call tutorials where I teach you how AI robots can automatically write. Now, taking a step further than this, what if we make AI itself work for writing AI stuff and AI giving uh, what you call commands for the same AI to start continuing on the work for the AI writing. So that means AI will write and then automatically AI itself will command. We appoint a boss for the AI for it to command in order to write. So this is, uh, so understand what I'm talking about. So this is AI tool, AI tool writing tool. Okay. AI writing, just put it like AI writing tool and we appoint a boss for the AI, which is like a boss AI. And then the boss AI commands the AI writing tool. So again, uh, now uh, the AI writing tool rewrites. Oh, sorry. In fact, uh, continues writing or rewrites. That's up to us to decide. Rewrites. Hold on. Yes. AI writing tool continues writing or rewrites or whatever. So you got the point. So I'm just going to show you how that works. So I'm heading over to text synth. So just type in text synth. I would have shown you this tool, but this is like pretty cool. So text synth. And now we're going to go for advanced stuff inside text synth, which nobody have taught ever in my life. So we're going to do that here right now. I'm going to leak the secrets, which is, you know, hidden in me for a long time. So here we are in bella.org slash text synth. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make the AI itself write. So uh, only first sentence we write, then we'll make sure AI writes an entire blog article. You can continue the same process to make AI write an entire book too. So I'll just start 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 off the procedure by saying the power of digital marketing um, is expanding today. Companies. That's it. So the book. Or the e, uh, the blog, uh, the ebook, or whatever should be ready. So now what I'm going to do is normally how do we use this? Okay, normally we are going to uh, hold on. We are going to just click complete text and automatically write. That I would have taught you. If you don't know about this, just um, you gotta see this. Okay, so it's gonna so write automatically. Okay, now when I click on more. It's going to continue from there, right? You understood the procedure, right? So this is a normal way. This is a normal way. Then you can edit whatever it has written. It's completely plagiarism free content, unique content. And you can be clicking on more and writes, right? Now we are going to appoint an AI boss for this. Okay. This is the normal process and it also writes fiction. It also writes whatever you want, not just nonfiction. Now we're going to appoint an AI boss, which is the first time in the world. I'm going to teach you that, which nobody have ever taught. Uh, so what is the AI boss going to do? It's going to command this AI text in to actually click on more autonomously without human intervention. Now we click on more in the manual way, right? So that it starts to complete continue writing the sentences. Now, the, if you don't click on more, what's going to happen? It's going to stop there after a few words, correct? Now, when you keep on clicking on more, it's going to automatically, you don't have to change any kind of temperature, top keywords, temperature, nothing. Just have it as GPT J6 billion. Now, the biggest question is how do you make the AI to click on more again and again so that we get a book itself automatically? Simple as that. It, it should go, it should click on more, it should write. It should go, it should click on more, it should write. So how is that possible? Uh, so for that, we have a solution. It's called Repeater on the Mac App Store. This works only for Mac. Um, if you are using a Windows, um, you have to use another tool. So I'm going to talk to you about Mac tool. It's called repeater Mac app store. Just type that in. And this is the one you'll find a mouse, uh, kind of a mouse. This is the one. Hold on. This is the one. This is a free tool, completely free tool repeater. 
this is the mouse with the um, what do you call it is um, about to click button <laughs> uh, mouse with the whatever button right so this is going to automate uh, the stuff for us if you're using a windows you got to go to free macro tools so again, Google for that. So free macro tools. So we have a lot of macro tools like macro recorder, macro recorder, record mouse and keyboard actions for infinite replay um, on all this stuff. So this will automatically do the stuff for Windows. So record, perform the actions that you have performed one, then press stop and edit the macro, press play, whatever, automate everything using AI. I'm gonna show you how this works typically, right? Just explaining what would not work here. I'm gonna show you how this works. And what is this got to do with the supercomputer? When you run on the supercomputer, you can have many instances of text in. Understand, so one supercomputer can have like 10 browsers, 10 books, ebooks created in minutes, believe it or not. So you, if you wanna expand that 100 browsers, that's up to you, the hundreds of, ebooks can be created. So I'll just show you how this works. It's a completely free tool, so don't worry. Um, hold on. So I'm gonna go to repeater. I'm gonna open that mouse one. Okay, I got that here. So I put that here. So now um, I'm gonna copy this. I'm gonna reload the page. That's easier for me. I'm gonna put that text here again. I'm gonna head over to repeater. So what I'm gonna do in repeater is, uh, you see this record button, guys? So I'm gonna automatically click on this record button. And I'm going to click on this here. I click on there, you understood. And then I click on complete text. And I'm going to wait for some time because every time the iterations instance occurs, it will be a different, um, you know, time, right? So now I wait for it. I wait for it. I wait for it. Don't worry. Be happy. Now what I'm going to do is, yeah, this, this much time is fine, right? Yeah. So now I can head over back to repeater. And then there's a loop that you see a loop, guys like this arrow, I'm gonna click on that. You see a play button, right? I'm gonna click on play, click on play. And now I've left my mouse cursor. Now it's automatically, it will click on, I, I should have done one thing. Actually, I should have generated, uh, I should have clicked on more, but let's see what happens now, hold on. So it's waiting for it, let's see what happens. Um, Let's see where, where, where it takes us actually. So I did um, a small mistake, but uh, let's see what happens. So just give me a minute. So I should have not click on generate. So just give me one minute. Let me try it again. So now it's generated this much. So I, I, I click on the, uh, hold on, don't save this recording. So hold on, hold on. So don't save this recording. Yeah. Now click on here and click on more. Yeah. So it automatically writes, correct. So automatically writes. Then it should stop okay it should stop after some point of time hold on just yeah it stopped but i'm waiting for you know 10 more seconds yeah then i again click on more hold on for a second okay now now again it let, let, let it do the magic okay it's it's stopped now so hold on now i go back to repeater so stop this so now I gotta loop this play. So let me see what happens. Now I looped it. Now let's see what it does. Now it's automatically clicking on more. You saw the guys? So now it'll stop. Okay, let, let it stop, let it stop. Let it stop. And then now, now the mouse cursor would move again. Just give it some time. Just give it like 10 more, 20 more seconds. And now it's gonna move again. Let's see, automatically it moves because I'm not moving the cursor. Yeah, there it is moving automatically. Click on more. And then it'll stop and again it'll click on more. And it's so it'll do this procedure completely. So each time it clicks on more, it generates like two paragraphs or three paragraphs or one paragraph, it depends. Uh, so it just loop this process. So it'll automatically keep on clicking on more. So it'll, it'll automatically go and stop the repeater and then it'll come back, it'll click on more. Simple as that, then it'll follow the same iteration. You understood the concept, right? So I'm gonna stop repeater. Okay, so I'm gonna stop this. So now let's see how much it is written. So if you leave this for one hour, understand I'll write an entire book. So I've just written like say a page of content, but if you leave this for one hour, then once you click on, keep on click on more, right? And uh, use utilize the power of artificial intelligence automation for click on, clicking on more, you know, automatically to write books. So, so it all depends on how much, how many more clicks it does. So uh, leave it one hour and I'll write a complete book. Don't worry about that, okay? So maybe you'll have a like hundred pages, 150 pages. If you want to write more, you can do that. So that's a fastest way. And then you can, obviously you can, if you want to change anything, you can change it. 
and uh, I just gave a sentence. It generated an entire book from this particular sentence. This is the fastest way that a robot would ex instruct a robot to actually write and command it to write. So this is the fastest way with texting. Now, what it's got to do with the cloud computer? Again, I'm telling you, you're running it on one browser on a normal Mac. Now, when it, when you run it on cloud computers, it's the the it'll be the faster time to actually generate content. Um, okay, I got a kind of a message in my phone that says a blip, but don't worry about that because there are lots of fans pinging me. Don't worry. Yeah. So what I was saying was, yeah, the uh, normal, right? So normal, normal computers, it's different, but supercomputers, you can make this into hundred browser windows and then start, uh, you know, uh, automating this process. So this is the fastest way that you can actually leverage, right? This is a secret. Don't link it to anybody in the world because this can also write fiction, by the way. Yes. See you on day four with some of the amazing content that I'm bringing in.